This is a tutorial on how to do a Jarred Remains, the extreme track of Fire in the Deep, the fourth DLC. Obviously you'd be using the Pit Viper for this too. can do it on the Roach, but 10 times easier on the Pit Viper. So what you want to do here is just full throttle in hit with your back tire first when you get up to the checkpoint like this then you lean forward and then hit the brake so you can just get up like this which should be easy enough just full forward lean back lean forward remember to hit your back tire first makes it easy and you full throttle while seated back and then lean forward and back quickly so you do a small jump and then you position yourself full throttle it front tire on first didn't get this checkpoint easily. Here you just full throttle it, lean back, get over to this easily. Then there's multiple ways you can do this. You can do it by full throttling like this. It's doable. You can do it by jumping on it and then just lean back and forward. Brake while your front tire hits or back tire hits uh, the middle part of it. Here where your front tire is now. If you brake there with the back tire then you get less air time. And you can back wheel bounce off it too. See if I can do that. Yes, like that. Then you just full throttle over to this, which is pretty simple. Here, what you want to do is kind of jump and do a jump and then hit lock it with your back tire so you just swing down like this. Swing down there. Sometimes you swing too far, sometimes you don't. Sometimes you need to hold the brake, other times you just need to tap it. Like there, I held it too long so I didn't get far enough. And now I just tapped it, got perfectly down. Then you can either land here and then stop and then jump over to this and then position yourself and full throttle it get over easily or just try and go with, without stopping at all like that those are two ways of doing it this one I recommend you to go back here and then lean back while going and you just lean forward when you get up to this do a small jump onto this then you when you land you lean forward a bit so you position kind of like this and then you lean back and forward again so you keep momentum or you just get on it start stay like this then full throttle up see if you can get up like that definitely easier if you jump on it and lean, then get in the normal position then lean back and forward like this uh, that goes so well now but oh that could work then lean forward, you lean back, lean forward, lean back, lean forward. And you just tap the brake a few times while leaning forward so you get up with your front tire and then you can just push yourself forward and get the checkpoint. Here you can do this multiple ways too. You can just full throttle it and then do a jump over and then position yourself to go up. Then you just don't full throttle it first, you just give a bit of speed first and then you give it more speed and more speed and more speed and then you brake and then we'll roll over so you get the checkpoint. Or you can try and hit the tip of the pipe like this so you can keep going but if you hit it good enough then you can just keep going without losing any speed but then hit brake up here and then lean forward and it checkpoint easily here you just lean back while full throttling keep throttling lean back a bit find that easiest but you can stop on every single one of them I think and then still clear it even though this is not so easy to stop on this but you can stop on all of them This one, you just try and get up. I find it easy just to do like this, lean forward, tiny bit so you position it perfe perfectly, and then just keep rolling. Easy. Try and get full speed from here, do a tiny jump. Lean, hit the back tire first so you keep momentum and get up here. I think you can still do it without keeping momentum, but I'm not sure. And you'd have to do a uh, switch jump, I guess, kinda. That seems more difficult. Just go back here, full throttle it. You don't even have to do a small jump, but it makes it easier to clear up. And here you just do a small jump, so you make sure you clear it and land down at the checkpoint. Here you want to hit with your back tire first, and then just keep leaning back a bit, so you make sure you clear it up to this part. Might do a small jump too, to uh, do a better clear, like uh, this. Not so good though. 
uh, small jump like that, cleared better and just full throttle it so you get up here, or you can go slow up, but I think it's easier with full throttling while leaning forward and then you just drop down, not go, be careful of going too far. This one I think you need to have a lot of speed on track with cleared, so you can go back here and full throttle it to jump on it and do another jump and get over, but I think you might be able to just get on it and then throttle from there. No, you do not. So you have to go back here, full throttle, do a tiny jump on it, and then keep you leaning back, and lean forward. Then you can do a front flip, then try and just get your back tire, or just try and hit your front tire on it, like this. But back tire, front flip is probably easier, and you just gotta tap your brake a few times. So then you can just full throttle while being seated back, and get up here, and then you just do a jump like this, get up. I think you can also do it if you're just on it like this, but you can do a switch jump, but that might be more difficult than trying to do it all in one go. I'm gonna try it a few times, see if I can do with the switch jump. I think it's more difficult, just try and be seated back, get on it, and jump, and then try and get up here so you can just yourself. In the ending you can do multiple ways or two ways. You can do it if you keep momentum then from here you can just jump all the way over and then keep going up. Hit your back tire first and lean forward to keep tapping the brake so you get more uh, forward swing or you can just go up here to the checkpoint and be seated back while full throttling and do a small a quick forward back motion like this and do it again then just keep trying to hit your back tire first on it. That's how you do uh, Chared Remains 4th uh, DLC. Now I'll show you my run of it. <laughs> 